Greetings, everyone. P. Pardo here from Sea Tranquility. Welcome to another episode of What's Hot with Sea Tranquility. It's Wednesday, that's right. First Wednesday of the new year here in 2024. We're still playing catch up on stragglers from 2023. We got we got two for you here today. Pretty probably should have done this a couple weeks ago when I reviewed the other uh, kind of reissue from Charisma Records from Arabs and Aspic, the great Norwegian heavy prog band. We've got two for you here today. This is uh, reissues of their third and fourth albums, which were originally released on Black Widow Records. They've now been remixed, remastered, re-edited. Uh, they changed the, the track order, added in some extra vocals and things like that, and they sound fantastic. So the first one is Pictures in a Dream. Okay, and this one was originally released in 2013, and then Victims of Your Father's Agony, which came out in 2015. Like I said, these uh, originally on Black Widow, now on Charisma Records, uh, absolutely terrific. And I, I reviewed this one recently, okay, which is The Magic of Sin, which uh, basically uh, was a reworking of one of their earlier albums, now given a new title with English lyrics and English title and all that sort of stuff but uh, yeah these are great if you've never listened to Arabs and Aspic um, they're a prog band but they're much heavier than what you normally expect from prog to me they're like this perfect blend of like Atomic Rooster Uriah Heap Black Sabbath with some of kind of what you'd expect from Norwegian prog rock all colliding big heavy riffs loads of Hammond organ you got occasional Mellotron things like that outstanding vocals lots of jamming lots of jamming there's there's a psychedelic element to this music as well which I really like but the, the big heavy riffing is great and it's just kind of like ominous feel and the the way the Hammond organs are recorded just really good so let's take a look at these uh, reissues here okay Outstanding artwork, a little bizarre at times, right? But I think still outstanding. I'll tell you who's in the band in a second. Of course, Tala needs to go. Tala wants in, Tala wants out. Never happy wherever she is. Got cool live shots there. So we've got um, on this album anyway, you got uh, Iskil Nihus. I'm going to butcher these names, on drums percussion. You've got uh, Justine Smeby on guitars and vocals. You've got uh, Stig Arve Jorgensen on organ, keyboards, and vocals. You've got Eric Paulsen on bass guitar, fretless bass, and vocals. And that is for uh, this particular album. What's really interesting here, so this is Pictures in a Dream, and I know you can't see that, so on the one spine it says Pictures in a Dream, and then they messed up on the other spine it says... Uh, Stranger, Strange Frame of Mind, which is another album of theirs that was also reissued recently. So, oops, a little QC uh, miscue there. So here's the other album. Again, most of their albums have very interesting uh, album art, which I think is very unique to them. And if we look to the booklet here, lyrics, no photographs here, but uh, I believe this is the same lineup on this particular album yeah joystein smebi guitars and vocals eskil nihus drums and percussion stig Kvam jorgensen keyboards acoustic guitar and vocals and eric paulsen on bass and vocals so uh, yeah really good stuff here i'm not going to get into all the tracks and stuff because there's a lot of them but i would say that you guys if you're interested in heavy heavy progressive rock that borders on just classic 70s heavy rock with some psychedelic influences you can't go wrong with Arabs and Aspic and these two albums are absolutely outstanding this whole reissue uh, series that Charisma has been doing are, are well worth checking into and getting them all because they're all really really good so uh, there you have it each one four out of five star without a doubt Go investigate Arabs and Aspic, another great Norwegian band. There's so many great Norwegian bands right now. It's just ridiculous. Scandinavia is just knocking out of the park between Norway and Sweden and even Finland. I mean, it's just crazy good stuff coming out of there. And uh, but these albums obviously are about a decade old each. So, but yeah, definitely worth your time. I think uh, Jacob Holm Lupo has done a great job on uh, remixing these. They sound spectacular. Good, heavy, heavy rock and prog. Go check them out and visit us on the web at www.seatranquility.org. We're on Facebook, we're on YouTube all together all the damn time. Please subscribe if you haven't already and click on that notification bell so you get alert of all of our content as it post. And please do hit the like button before you leave. Also down below, we got the links to our Ko-Fi page for channel donations, our merch page where you can get all sorts of cool Sea Tranquility gear and our cameo page for personalized videos from myself. Thanks in advance for all your support there and we'll see you soon here. I am Pete Pardo. Take care. Bye-bye.